Our world has so many unique and beautiful environments, and I feel incredibly grateful to call one of them my home. Australia, and specifically my home here in Queensland, we have some of the most beautiful, colourful, majestic, invasive, creepy, and dangerous animals on the planet. And I find it quite special that I have the opportunity to look for some of these species and capture them, not with my hands, but through the lens of my camera, allowing me a chance to interact with them without disturbing them and take a piece of them home with me. Finding and filming these animals isn't the easiest thing to do, especially on 16 millimeter or film in general. It requires a great deal of patience and most of the time you get nothing. You spend majority of the time just watching and waiting for things to happen. Which is partly what I find so therapeutic because I think anyone who tries to capture something through a camera knows that it can quickly become a barrier between you and the subject that you're filming. The ability to prevent that from happening isn't an easy thing to achieve and failing to do so might mean that we miss what's really important because sometimes it's worth not having a camera pointed at something all of the time. Some of the most precious moments can be kept to yourself and I think this way of shooting has allowed me to do that. I feel we start to lose some of the magic that comes from creating anything when we start to chase the cutting edge, thinking that it'll solve all of our problems. Personally, I find value in using something that's considered some relic or prehistoric tool that belongs in the past. I don't care much for sensor sizes or pixel density. I just care to use what brings me an immense amount of joy. This format, I get looks of confusion, and I'm reminded that there's much better options. But I think what's misunderstood or forgotten is that we should be doing something or creating something because we love it, not because it's fast, easy, or convenient. Who cares if it's with the phone in your pocket or a 16 millimeter camera? It doesn't matter who, why, or what you choose to film or film with. As long as it's done for the right reasons. As long as it's being done for yourself. Ultimately, I feel we should create with what we love and or with what we already have. 